Testosterone is an androgen hormone produced by the adrenal cortex, the testes, and the ovaries. It is often considered the primary sex hormone associated with those assigned male at birth. Testosterone stimulates the development of secondary sex characteristics associated with males, like body hair and muscle growth, and is essential in the production of sperm. In this video, we will talk about why testosterone is important. But before this put like to the video and subscribe in the channel if watch us the first time. Too much testosterone can cause infertility in any gender. Testosterone supplementation can also increase the risk of stroke, hypertension, accumulation of red blood cells, heart attack, leg clots, pulmonary embolus, and cancer. The FDA only approves its use for hypogonadism and does not recommend its use for low testosterone. Use due to aging. The Endocrine Society, on the other hand, supports its possible use in older men with confirmed testosterone deficiency aiming to achieve a low normal level of the hormone, but only after carefully reviewing the risks and benefits. The Effects of Testosterone on the Body Testosterone is an important male hormone. A male begins to produce testosterone as early as seven weeks after conception. Testosterone levels rise during puberty, peak during the late teen years and then level off. After age 30 or so, it's normal for a man's testosterone levels to decrease slightly every year. 1. Development of Sperm Testosterone is essential to the production of sperm in the testes. It is a delicate balance, however. Both too little and too much testosterone can lead to low sperm counts. 2. Endocrine System The body's endocrine system consists of glands that manufacture hormones, the hypothalamus, located in the brain, tells the pituitary gland how much testosterone the body needs. The pituitary gland then sends the message to the testicles. Most testosterone is produced in the testicles, but small amounts come from the adrenal glands, which are located just above the kidneys in women. The adrenal glands and ovaries produce small amounts of testosterone before a boy is even born. Testosterone is working to form male genitals during puberty. Testosterone is responsible for the development of male attributes like a deeper voice, beard, and body hair. It also promotes muscle mass and sex drive. Testosterone production surges during adolescence and peaks in the late teens or early 20s. After age 30, it's natural for testosterone levels to drop by about 1% each year. 3. Essential to the development of eggs in the ovaries. Androgens play an important role in ovarian foal. Legal development and estrogen production. 8. 4. Sex drive libido. The connection between testosterone and sex drive is well known. Higher levels of testosterone cause higher levels of sexual appetite. 5. Building muscle mass. Cisgender men are more likely to develop muscle mass than cis women because of their higher testosterone levels. 6. Pain tolerance. Testosterone may help people regulate pain levels. 7. Circulatory system. Testosterone travels around the body in the bloodstream. The only way to know your testosterone level for sure is to have it measured. This usually requires a blood test. Testosterone spurs the bone marrow to produce red blood cells and studies suggest that testosterone may have a positive effect on the heart. But some studies investigating testosterone's effect on cholesterol, blood pressure, and clot-busting ability have had mixed results when it comes to testosterone therapy and the heart. Recent studies have conflicting results and are ongoing. Testosterone therapy delivered by intramuscular injection may cause blood cell counts to rise. Other side effects of testosterone replacement therapy include fluid retention, increased red cell count, and cholesterol changes. How do you know if you have low testosterone? The only way to know your testosterone level is with a blood test. You may talk to your healthcare provider about a testosterone level test if you have symptoms of low testosterone. Not everyone with low testosterone has symptoms, but these can include low sex drive, hair loss, fertility problems, or erectile dysfunction. Typical testosterone levels are between 300 and 750 nanograms per deciliter and DL. After age 30, Testosterone levels decrease by around 2% each year. When would someone need a testosterone test? Healthcare providers usually order testosterone tests for people assigned male at birth AMOB who have symptoms of low testosterone. 
or medical conditions associated with low testosterone, such as development of breast tissue, erectile dysfunction, hair loss, infertility, low muscle mass, low sex drive.